Okay, so this is all the Lord of the Rings and the Hobbit stuff I have. Okay, yeah. Just, yeah. Just go. Just go. Please. Please. Uh, yeah. So, let's start with my necklace I got for Christmas. It is the one ring. It actually does not fit me. You can... It is removable and stuff. There's... You don't... You can't just, like, put it on. It's just, like... Yeah. You have to put it on. Very annoying. I still can't get used to that. Um... Next, moving on to phone case. I actually recently got this one like a couple weeks ago. Well, my dad got it for me. It is the One Ring phone case. The time that my phone had an upgrade, um, because my phone case was literally like last like I don't know like at least a year. So it was like butterf purple butterfly. I just kind of got bored of that. So <laughs> now that I like Lord of the Rings. And Hobbit, obviously I had to get it. Um, next, moving on to music. Since I really like the music from Lord of the Rings and The Hobbit, I like it from the, the, one of the things from The Hobbit more. Well, as well as Lord of the Rings, I really like The Return of the King and The Two Towers for some reason. I don't know why I like The Fellowship. No, I don't really like The Fellowship of the Rings. So actually, the first thing that I got, so it came with a whole set of all three. The Fellowship of the Ring, The Two Towers, and The Return of the King. This is the working version. So the first set I got, okay, so this is the old CD. I tried it like a million times. It does not work. I was really excited for that one because that one was like my favourite because I really like like the Battle of Pelennor Fields and stuff. So this one did not work. So then my dad came back from like a tour or something and then... He got me another thing, and I'm really happy, because now I finally get to listen to the music. I mean, I do sometimes use, um, I don't know, like my iPad and my phone for music, but like, if I just want to play a game or something, and I just put, and I'm just not bothered, I just put some music on right there. Right there. <laughs> yeah, I'm just pointing so yeah i also have a moving on to mugs i have two mugs well i only got into like lord of the rings like a year ago so i don't really have much but yeah i still love lord of the rings <laughs> no, i don't know why okay um so first because i love cats i decided to get a mug well i got it for christmas yeah it's called Lord of the Cats, The Fellowship of the Ring, and then it has all of the Fellowship members. Uh, Gandalf, Aragorn, Legolas, Merry Pippin, uh, Legolas, Gimli, and and Frodo and Sam, yeah. Oh, oh wait, Boromir. Yeah. yeah. Okay, that's it. Um, for mugs. Oh, yeah, I have one more mug. I was just drinking out of it, so, yeah. Let me just go quickly get that. So I was just, so this is the, every single time, because my favourite verse from The Hobbit is the Desolation of Smaug. I just really, for some reason, just don't like the Battle of the Five Armies because it's quite tragic and just Thorin, Feely, Keely, yeah, blah, blah, blah. Um, but I really, really like The Hobbit of the Desolation of Smaug. Desolation of Smaug. So... I got it for my birthday. I actually still use it a lot. This is probably my favourite mug of all. Um, yeah. It's just like, yeah. It has Erebor and everything. So, and the dragon. I even have a map of the dragon from my book of the Hobbit. But I have no clue where that is right now. Because I have a bunch of paper around me. Like in those in those drawers over there. So, yeah. yeah. Okay, next I have a bag that I got for Christmas. Oh, I can't figure out how to put this on. Okay, um, it is a bag of Gondor, because I really like Gondor. Yeah, a Gondor bag. And it's purple, I guess, my third favourite colour also. Or, like, lavender coloured or something. So, yeah. Yeah, love it. Okay. 
Yeah, so actually my dad introduced me. So we were like basically like watching films like Avatar, Avatar and stuff. Then I became obsessed with Avatar for like one day or something. Until I was like, oh, I want to watch a new movie. And then we ended up watching The Lord of the Rings. But we, but he didn't set up like everything. He didn't buy the extended version or anything. So I just had like the CDs and stuff of it to put on on my telly right there, actually, right above the, this. Yeah, and um, basically, I started watching like a tiny bit of it, and then I was like, oh, this, I I don't really like this. It's like a battle scene or something. But however, then when it got past like all the ring making and like the battles and well, not the ring making, but like the introduction, I guess. When we got past that, I actually was really interested in it. And I guess we were stopping it like a thousand times every every single movie that we watched. Um, because I was like, oh, what was that? that, that yeah, I was just, and then it got mixed up with Sauron and Sour Man and stuff. And I was like, oh, so he turns evil. And then and I was like, oh, wait, no, so what, what was that? And then I was just asking like a ton of questions. So that's kind of, yeah. And then, and there, so this is like just the normal version. Then we went to the extended version then i started watching the hobbit and then i was like oh my god i love this and, and then by now i've probably watched the lord of the rings um probably like 15 times or something and then the hobbit are probably like 10 times or something because i just watched the lord of the rings more for some reason however i did recently finish watching the hobbit again so that's probably like 11 times yeah uh, and uh, anyways enough talking about that um, here is something I made. I really don't know if this counts as something that I made, that, like, um, that is Lord of the Rings merch and stuff. But I made this Hobbit house. I know it n looks nothing like, um, Bilbo's Hobbit house, like, just, like, green. I just put some rocks from my garden, and I, j and I just tried to make it as best as I could. <laughs> and for, like, first experience, I think that's pretty, this is pretty good. I actually really love it. It was really hard to get the cardboard in place, and as you can see, you can still see the um, tape. <laughs> yeah. Um, next, I don't know if this counts either, but I have this um, Hamley's cat. I actually have two of them. Yeah, um, because um, I don't, I, because like the Frollo ship of the ring mug. So yeah, um, and basically, I made like the green. I don't really. I for some reason I got an. Um, this reminded me of the Harry Potter green. I do. I really don't like Harry Potter, actually. Even though I've never watched it, I just really don't want to watch Harry Potter. All of those people who are like, I love Harry Potter. I, yeah. Um, well, that is my opinion. I love Lord of the Rings and The Hobbit more. I just love cats and stuff, so I just crocheted this. I actually have a crochet basket by there. My nan actually went to a sale and she got all, a, a whole box of that wool for just one pound. So yeah, I can crochet more things. Oh, moving on to games. I have this game of Lord of the Rings Monopoly. Oh, I love this game. Me and my dad are actually still in the middle of a game. Um... It is really fun. It's an, um, I still no, we still don't play exactly by the rules because um, the money is so hard to get, and I just and we just don't really figure out. So I'm like, no, you don't have to pay me rent. Yeah. <laughs> I keep this case. Um, and um, we're still in the middle of the game. <laughs> we um, we've played it for like three days, and we still have not finished it yeah um so like nobody can uh, none of us it's just me and my dad playing the game <laughs> um none of us can get the ring to mount doom so yeah anyways another thing is lord drinks playing cards i only play with 36 though but it has like the one two oh and i really love it um i got one pair of the of just like one pair like yeah and then I took them to France with me. Well, I actually took two pairs of cards. One of normal cards, which is just 36, old. or And Lord of the Rings ones, which I had to separate because of like 36. Because we only play from like 6, then 7, 8, 9, 10. And then like the king and blah, blah, blah. And yeah, and the ace, and the spades. And yeah, um, kind of like that. So, but then 
somehow I lost them. So I asked my dad to get me a new pair. And I still haven't not opened them. I've just been waiting to make this video. So let's just quickly open my um, new pair. Yeah. And box it. Sorry, I just really, really... Um, just as soon as I lose one, I'm, I'm just, like, not bothered. I'm, I'm just, like, really, really bothered that I lost it. So I just have to get a new pair, obviously. Because I obviously just... Yeah. Even one of my friends thinks that I'm crazy about Lord of the Rings and I'm just way too upset. So I'm like, well, of course. So every single time I get a new something like new from Lord of the Rings, and he's because he's only what no, because he's only watched The Hobbit, um, and I'm like crazy about it because like um 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 um, <laughs> and it's just like just like can you play like, please like. And then he's like, why would you not have Lord of the Rings in the um, phone case? Or why would you not have a Lord of the Rings thing that you just got? And, ooh, and here it is. Yes. I unboxed it. Yes. Finally. The moment I've been waiting for. My new set of playing cards. Sorry. Yeah. And, uh, <laughs> okay, next thing. Um, let's just move on to books, I guess. Because I have quite a lot of books. So, this one is quite healthy. Um, this is Tolkien, Maker of Middle Earth. Um, most of these books I got for Christmas and for my birthday. Because basically I was like, on my birthday I got one book. And I was like, uh, what is this hard? Because I don't really like books. But um, Lord of the Rings ones, obviously I'll have to read them. <laughs> um, so... My Lord of the Rings diary. Well, I actually made up my own language using some of the um, letters from The Hobbit and stuff, like in Dwarfish, I guess. <laughs> uh, let's just say uh, you don't think it's really good, and I've only written like three pages of it, and I've got it for like Christmas. Yeah. <laughs> it's funny. Um, so I, I was like, first book, wow. And I just wasn't really surprised. I just was not surprised. Like, or, like, surprised. I don't know. Um, and then, like, I don't know. It, all, it, like, happened. Then I was, like, another one of them wrapped in paper. Wrapping paper. And then I was, like, wow, it's another book. So then one of those, another coming, you know, like, let me guess. Is it Lord of the Rings or The Hobbit book? And, and then guess what? I opened it. I'm, like, yay! So, yeah. And ignore me. I just came from a party, like, or something and i just had food so <laughs> yeah so this book is actually quite heavy it's quite big yeah i i keep everything in my room i have a whole entire library bad idea um okay oh and there's a speech on the back it is written in my lifeblood such as that is thick or thin and i can no other grr Tolkien. Ooh. Um, next I have this Lord of the Rings sketchbook, a bunch of pictures from the, a bunch of original pictures from the Lord of the Rings, and it has, like, a description. I just love spelling books. Um, Alan Lee, and it's just, like, really, really beautiful. I love it. I'm pretty sure that is Kirithungal, or Serifungal, however you call it. Um, next I have... The Hobbit sketchbook. Well, most of these are from my grandma and stuff, but um, and I really, really love them, but I barely even read them. Okay, so finally, something that um, you have been waiting for, probably. The Hobbit. I took some of these letters to put in my diary. So, yeah. For some reason, I just didn't think anything through to making this video. But, um, I probably, wait, let me just read how many pages I got through. Um, I got up to page 47, and <laughs> so I stopped reading it. I, I just, I just really don't really read these type of books, unless I'm, I'm like, you know, my parents are like, you have to read books. And I'm like, okay, and then, and then I just read books, and then I actually enjoy it. Because once I was actually obsessed with, like, reading The Worst Witch until my mum lost two of my books. And I haven't, because she hides it, like, literally and then there is The Hobbit, The Desolation of Smaug book. All about Smaug, unleashing the dragon. Unleashing the dragon. 
Do what? Unle yeah, unleashing. <laughs> Fred. <laughs> I'm such a bad reader. Um, forward. Forward by Benedict Cumberbatch. Oh, wait, that's the person who plays Smaug. Oh, oopsies. Um, then next I have got the book of the Atlas of the Atlas of Tolkien's Middle Earth. So yeah, I really had um, a bunch of things. Like yeah, yeah, things, things. <laughs> um, next I have got the world of G.R.R. Tolkien, and obviously I'm only interested in the world of G.R.R. Tolkien, which is Middle Earth and Valinor and stuff, like the things from Lord of the Rings and the Hobbit, and. Um, yeah, Lord, um, Rings of Power Season 2 is coming out, so I'm going to watch that. Yeah. Oh, I completely forgot about my sword. Oh, I was waiting, like, m I was re waiting weeks for this to arrive. Weeks. And I mean weeks. It was, I was, like, waiting so bad for this. And then, like, and then it finally arrived. I'm like, it's all the way, it's literally an hour away. So I have to know, so then I have to know, so then no, um, I have to drive, no, we, um, me and my dad have to drive like an hour to get it. And then we have to wait another half an hour in the waiting room for ours. And I'm like, yes, finally. And then as soon as we get to the car, just unpack it because I'm just way too excited. And then obviously it does not fit in the fr front car seat. So, <laughs> um, yeah, it gets a bit crazy there. Um, yeah, and plus very uncomfortable for driving. Um, next I, oh wait, why am I grabbing the box? Oh yeah, um, next book, I actually really enjoy this one because it's Recipes from the World of Tolkien. And I have already baked some potatoes and like, ooh, lambus bread. I guess that's something I should bake next. Um, because I really, really like cooking lambus bread or, yeah, wait, what? Right here. Uh, um, Lembus bread. Wait. Um, according to the Silmarillion and the Afterlife of Lord of the Rings, I'm pretty sure. Um, now Lembus is Lembus is first made by Yavanna, the Valerian queen. Or, eh. um, yeah, something. Okay, Galadriel's gifts the Fellowship a stock of Lembus. <laughs> it does. Is it Lembus bread or Lambus bread? Um. What do you think? Um, gifts a stock of Lambus bread. <laughs> so I'm just so used to saying Lambus bread. Each uh, Lambus breads, each wrapped in no, Malorn leaves the sustained and blah blah blah. Um, anyways, I'll have to read that. Um, okay, Beorn's honey cakes. Nope, I'm pretty sure it was like, um. Um, travel service, porridge, nope, breakfast, nope, 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 <sighs> spice burn, crumbling muffin, nope, um, Baron's potato bread, yeah, I'm pretty sure that's the thing, I can't, I'm not even bothered to read it, um, anyways, this video is already very, very long, so let's just get to the last book, okay, right here, <sighs> and Middle Earth Traveller. Okay, so, um, Tam, would you not mind reading this for me? Hello? Yeah, looks like he's asleep, so, yeah. Um, um, okay, sketches from Bag End to Mordor. Where is Bag End? Hobbiton, or Hobbiton the Shire? Wait, so there's the Shire, then there's Hobbiton in the Shire, or is it near the Shire? Like outside the Shire, or is it like near Bree or something? Yeah, I'm just really confused with all of that stuff, even though I do still have a map in my bedroom. <laughs> Literally just hanging from the wall. Okay, so, um, yeah, that is my final book. And then I will probably. That is probably it with my Lord of the Rings stuff. Sorry, I just saw my favorite chocolate. Right, right there. Yeah, and um, 
I think that will be it for now. And I will... Oh, the diary! Oh my god. Uh, so, yeah, um, I will just quickly go and get the diary. Let's just quickly climb over a table. So many, many things. Ooh, wait! Let's go. I'm a Legolas. Yeah. Um, sorry, I just have this thing with bells. Okay, I do have a little bit of a map right here. Um... I've written like a tiny bit in it, so yeah. The last time I've written it in in it was probably like in was in the sixth month of twenty twenty four. So <laughs> very long time. Uh yeah. So that's probably all my ordering stuff. Um I will show you a picture of my map soon. So yeah. So I just watched the video and the map is right behind me. Sorry, I just can't control the things. And I just figured out that um um I next to my Chronicles of Narnia books um I found my playing cards here, but they're basically empty. Let's just quickly go over here and show you the map. So yeah, so this is the map. Okay, Mordor. Um, yeah. The Shire, if you can't see that. Over there. Then there is Gondor over there or something. I don't know, but yeah. Bye.